Hello students, welcome back. Let's take up the next question. So the next question is a question from electricity chapter. It reads two lamp, one rated 100 watt at 220 volt and another 60 watt at 220 volt are connected in parallel to electric main supply. What current is drawn from the line if the supply voltage is 220 volt? Okay, so here we have two bulbs which are connected in parallel to a supply voltage of 220 volt and what is given the lamps one rated 100 watt and 220 volt so for this bulb the power is given as 100 watt and voltage is 220 volt it's operating at 220 volt now this bulb power p2 is 60 watt and it is also operating at 220 volt. Why is the voltage same in both the cases? It's because they are connected in parallel to each other. And we know in a parallel circuit, the voltage across the ends of the circuit remains the same across the resistors. They remain the same whereas the current varies in each branch. So here the current will be different I1 and I2. If I is the total current flowing in the circuit, so these uh, the current will be divided in the two resistors and I1 and I2 current will flow in the individual resistors depending on their ratings. So in a CD circuit, the current remains the same. The voltage changes across each resistor whereas in parallel circuit, the voltage remains the same whereas the current across each resistor changes. So the total current is the sum of the individual currents which is flowing through, the each, through each branch. So, in order to get the total current I, we have to add the current through the two branches. So, how to find out the total current I? Now, we have power, we have the voltage. So, the equation which we will use is P is equal to VI. So, using this, we will find out the current flowing in each resistor or the lamp and then we will add them to find out the total current. So, let's find out. So, power 1 is given as 100 watt and voltage is 220 volt so for the first one current will be p e by v that is 100 by 220 that's 5 by 11 ampere similarly the power of the second bulb is given as 60 watt and it is also operating at 220 volt the, the current through the second bulb would be p2 by V which is 60 by 220 which is 3 by 11 ampere. So now the total current I will be 5 by 11 plus 5 by 11 plus 3 by 11 which is 8 by 11 ampere. So, the total current I will be 0 0.73 ampere. So, this is the total current which will flow in the circuit. Now, remember one thing that in a parallel circuit, when the resistors are connected in parallel, the overall resistance of the circuit decreases. Okay? Keep this in mind. You will need it in some other questions. So, this is the answer to this question that the current flowing through the circuit or the current drawn from the line is 0 0.73 ampere. So, this is all for today. I hope you have understood this. Thanks for watching.